Very good, we are here at uh, Rush Park. I'm gonna do a little flying. Here we go. Let's start. Take off. Trying the Aggies again here on 5.8 gigahertz. The home point has been updated. Please check it on the map. We just finished the uh, compass calibration and IMU calibration also. <laughs> Okay, we're going to head over in that direction. We're heading east. We did a really good calibration now. The direction on the map is uh, coinciding very well. It's, uh, Increase altitude a little bit more. I really like this uh, position where I am, right by Rush Park, Rush House here. Got the sun to my back, good view, nice clear. And there we are. <clears throat> Let's see. Distance uh, 400 feet. We're gonna do uh, a little test here. I'm gonna point the Yagi straight up, you see, in the blue signal. Down again at about uh, 20 degree elevation. We got two bars. Now, if I point the Yagi's down towards the ground, Yeah, loose. Okay, back up again, about 20 degree elevation. There we go. Now I'm going to turn 45 degrees to my right, lose the signal. Straight ahead, I'm going to turn 45 degrees to my left, lose the signal, down to one bar. These Yagis certainly do make a difference. Okay, we're going to continue going uh, forward. That's the uh, directionality here. Now I didn't do 180 degrees. Let, let me go ahead and do this. We're going to stop at 500 feet. I'm going to see what happens if I just turn around 180 degrees. Completely lose. Oh no, I got a little bit of signal there. But uh, I think I'm getting some kind of reflection from the trees here that are behind me. Now I'm just pointing again towards, uh, there it is. Got two bars again. Okay, let's continue forward. <clears throat> We're going forward now. I'm at a, up at 160 feet. Got 69% battery. I'm not gonna go, uh, beyond 50% battery for sure. Maintaining two bars. Good video feed with no uh, jumping, no, no uh, jitteriness at all. I'm gonna pan the camera down a bit so we can get uh, Oops, guess what? Didn't start the video. <laughs> there we go. I just uh, started the uh, recording to the SD card. Yeah, that's uh, a little oversight there. I didn't start that on time. But uh, the only difference here is now you got the high res um, video feed. And uh, we're going pretty good. Continuing straight east. Still got two bars. Looks like I might be uh, 
we might be able to reach the uh, other end of the park there. We're at a thousand uh, feet distance. Still maintaining. Uh, oh. Okay, let's. Uh, okay. Have to tilt down a little bit. Getting a little bit, of, possibly some interference there. We're down to one bar. Yeah. Maybe some interference on this channel. Okay, tilting the uh, antennas down. They're about five degrees now. Elevation. And still uh, going in and out of one to two bars there. Yeah, looking at the far end of the, uh, the park there. And uh, we're still in visual line of sight. That's for sure. Watching the batteries, uh, we're down to 53%. I think we're going to go ahead and turn around and back here at this point. Yeah, 52%. Let's turn around. I'm going to do slow. Now, I understand uh, the uh, signal from the sensitivity uh, on the broadside to the drone is not as good as uh, the front or the back. But, uh, yeah, I can see that. It just dropped off a bit. And we're pointing straight back to me. And at the same time, we're looking into the sun. So what I'm going to do here is uh, <clears throat> tilt camera down a bit so uh, we don't have... Oh, there we go. we we'll get a better view. Don't uh, get washed out by that bright. Okay, let's come back. Still maintaining uh, contact with one bar. We did not too bad. We have only about a four mile an hour wind, so uh, practically calm air, uh, calm uh, skies today, and beautiful weather. It's, uh, it's close to 80 degrees. And we're coming closer and closer. We're down to 40%. I think we're going to do just fine. We're doing good. I don't like it going down to 30%. I'm going to go switch over to sports mode. Bring me back a little faster here. Yeah, we're coming back a little faster. Okay. And of course, signal's coming up. Oh, we're getting really close now. Just over directly overhead. Back up a bit. Okay. You know, we're directly overhead. And uh, I'm going to get out of sports mode and we're going to come start coming down. And I'm going to look down. See where we're coming down on. Oh, tilt that down there. See, there we go. And let's start heading down. <coughs> Low battery warning. I know. Low battery warning. So I brought you home. If I turn you to the right and you can uh, probably see me. There. You can see me. Oh, raise a little bit. Should be directly below you here. No.
of the orientation here. Oh, let's head down. There you go. Now you see me. Down. I'm trying to wait for me and back up towards me here. <coughs> and we'll try this one more time with a fresh battery, fully charged battery. Landing. Okay, we'll stop the recording. Ripping batteries now. It's connecting. Almost ready. We're waiting for the GPS uh, green go. There we go. We're ready to go. Start the recording this time. And we'll do Take off. We'll do more of the same here. <laughs> Want to reset the uh, home point? See how we do that. Should be able to do that here. Problem is, the home point has been updated. Please check it on the map. Okay, we're good. Let's go. Forward and higher. Here we go. We're back again, going in that direction. We're going to head uh, directly east for a bit. And go back up to about 100 feet. Well, there we are. We're at 100 feet. Pretty much above all the trees for sure. And uh, let's tilt a little bit here. We'll make sure we're going directly east. There we go. <coughs> Yagis uh, are certainly not failing us. They're doing a wonderful job. Here in a uh, residential area, there's. Uh, always the, the chance of uh, dodgy type of uh, link uh, for remote control because of uh, multiple devices, uh, other services that uh, operate on the Wi-Fi band. More 2.4 gigahertz, uh, but also some on 5.8 gigahertz. Uh, for that reason, uh, it is advantageous to uh, use an antenna with uh, a little bit of gain and um, directionality here on the controller. This uh, helps to uh, give you some immunity from uh, interference that uh, causes, uh, just decreases the quality of the control. Now we're doing okay. I don't think I'm going to stay here very long. It's uh, sun's starting to go down, and uh, 
I'm starting to get some insects here. We uh, do have a problem with uh, mosquitoes here when uh, it starts getting dark because there are some uh, creeks, some uh, stagnant water in this area. And we're still doing good. <laughs> see, following that trail. Let's see if we continue with the same direction here. Uh, the good thing about staying over the park and not going over the residential homes, of course, is uh, there's probably less uh, Wi-Fi interference directly under us. Now, the, uh, see, we're down to one bar. Okay, two weeks. Let's uh, increase our altitude. That should bring up the signal strength. And we're going up. There you go. See, now we're up to two bars. Oh. Here, we'll go a little higher. And that brings our strength up a bit. There you go. We're going to stay 200 feet. And we'll continue. 67% on the battery, 66%. Practice flying, although we're just going back and forth uh, in the same uh, route, is uh, is good. It uh, increases familiarity with the um, handling of the craft and uh, and uh, makes it more comfortable just to do regular flying. We're still in a visual line of sight. I'm going to tilt the uh, camera down a bit here just to uh, keep the, uh, the scenery from washing out. So we're down to 62%, 61%. We'll turn back when we're around 50, or actually a little bit before that, maybe 55. And uh, let's see. Keeping a good contact here, it's not bad. Well, it's just one bar. You see the red dot there on the 5.8 gigahertz. One bar, but still maintaining contact. And uh, let's see, we're uh, coming about, pretty much coming pretty closely here to uh, the limit of my line of sight. Just a tiny little dot there in the distance. And we're down to 54%. I am going to uh, just turn around at a distance of 1750 feet because this is the maximum that I've flown. And we're almost to the end of the park there anyway. Yeah, let's go ahead and, uh, oh, signal is getting weak. Let's turn around, come back. Here we go. I see that when it's um, like in this direction here, signal uh, gets a weaker. Uh, no, it's it's holding up. Looking at the orientation, the effect on the signal. Okay, let's come back. And um, I'm sure you're going to do it in sport mode. Come back faster. That way, perhaps uh, battery. Uh, not drawing the battery too close towards the 30% mark here. We're at 47% on battery. Again, we're going to tilt down there. That way we get away from the uh, blinding sun. And uh, we're coming back in sports mode, so we're going to have uh, probably some battery left here. And we're only 500 feet distant. Oh. Okay. Now... Okay, we're at 200 feet altitude. Uh, we're going to go ahead and come down. And I'm going to look down and see where we're coming. There we go. See? And you can see me right there. Let's point down. Let's turn around. Back up.
Yeah, you can see me, I'm under a tree. I'm gonna get out clear out of the tree. Okay, and let's start coming down. came back and now uh, we're just getting to left a low power warning. So let's do a little low altitude flying along the sidewalk here. And use up a little bit of battery. Low battery warning. Now we got the warning, so I'm gonna bring you home. Here you go. Come this way, and you come right back to me. There you go. And just going to come back right up to me, and then we're going to land. Landing. Okay, I'm stopping the uh, recording on the SD card. Aircraft is off. New battery. This is my third and last battery for today. any moment. Okay. And uh, we are going to go ahead and restart the recording. Okay. Started the video recording on the SD card. Now we're going to uh, Let's try and do an automatic. Uh, oh. There we go. Let's Take off. The home point has been updated. Please check it on the map. And we'll do this one more time. We're going to do the same uh, path there. Increase altitude. Now three bars, good strong signal. Continue with three bars. And that's to two bars. We're gonna level off at around 200 feet altitude. There, we stay at 200 feet altitude. And now uh, we're continuing straight east again. I know it might seem a little boring, but uh, good reason for doing this. It's uh, regular practice. <coughs> Actually, I'm going to uh, go over to sports mode and see if we can get ourselves. Um, out a little faster in that direction there. We're maintaining uh, two bars, which is good. Two bars. I'm gonna go out to the distance we were at last time for 1750. We got 84% battery, which is great.
I'm going to take a look and see uh, if we can just make it to the other side of the park and back. Still have it in uh, line of sight here. Down to one bar on the... Uh, oh, caution. Okay. I think we're at our limit there. I'm not going to go any further than this. Yeah, just barely a little dot here. Let's take a look down. And see where we are. Okay, there's a couple swimming pools there. Good. Let's turn around and come back home. Now we're not going to use um, sports mode. We're just going to uh, head uh, back in normal, what they call P mode, position mode. I am really, really happy with uh, the performance of these Yagis. I'm getting a very smooth uh, video feed. The Yagis are elevated uh, mm, at about five degrees above the horizon here. Now, if I tilt them up, I'm just gonna tilt them up about 45 degrees not bad still have maintain let's go a little further than that 60 degrees yep that drop signal how about if we uh point them down towards the ground They're actually pointing down towards the ground and we must be getting enough reflection off the grass here i have it like pointing 45 degrees down towards the ground still maintaining good again uh let's see we're at 1600 feet now i'm going to uh turn to the right, I'm at 45 degrees. Signal is, becomes weak, okay? Again, turning 45 degrees now to my left. And um, must be getting, okay, weakness again. Straight ahead, and uh, again, we uh, have good contact. Just one, well, one bar. On and off one bar, let's see. We've got 64% on the battery. Now it's 62%. And we're still 1,400 feet away. I'm good. Just working on one bar on 5.8 gigs. I'm going to try something. I'm going to orient back, uh, turn around 180 degrees and see what effect that has on, on the field strength at this point. Still at one bar. Now we're completely uh, 180 degrees. Still at one bar. Okay. How about if we uh, come back in reverse? Coming back in reverse. I'm going to stop at 1,000 feet and we're going to do the orientation. Uh, we're going to turn around again, do a little yaw at 1,000 feet. And 52% battery, we're watching that very closely. Okay. We're back at uh, 1,000 feet there. Okay, let's uh, go ahead and do a yaw. And turning uh, leftwards. Heading, uh, yeah, look at that signal came up a bit. It's coming up a bit. 
That's amazing. Okay, now we're, the aircraft here is like a 90% away, pointing away, and the signal came up stronger. How about if we point this straight at us here? There. Yeah. Uh, interesting. Let's uh, turn it uh, 50, I mean 90 degrees uh, to the left from us. Signal stronger. Um, these uh, antennas, interesting. Signal is down. Um, okay, let's continue straight ahead. There seems to be more sensitivity uh, of these antennas in the drone uh, broadside to the left and right at this uh, at this distance. That's very interesting because uh, people generally have been saying that uh, the uh, sensitivity would be greater um, from the front or from the rear of the drone. Now we're down to 40 percent and uh, we're still 700 feet away. 39% battery. I think if we continue at uh, a normal speed, we should uh, make it back here just fine, just about in time. I'm going to start decreasing elevation. And uh, signal strength is coming up a bit here. We're up to two bars. That's good. Coming uh, a level off at around 100 feet elevation. the camera just a wee bit. Okay, we're continuing. We're going to level off at 100. Okay. <coughs> uh, yep, you can see me right there between the uh, I'm almost like def de uh, centered. Uh, yeah, I'm walking. You can see where I am right now. Centered uh, a little bit. That's um, centered. Me. Low battery warning. I know. That's where we're going to have to come down a little, a little more. We're doing fine. I think we'll uh, make it just fine here. I see it coming straight at me here. Doing good. Yep. We're down to uh, uh, 27 percent, 26 percent. Okay. I'm going to uh, step out of the way, and we're going to land. Landing. Landing. All done. And uh, we'll stop the recording. And uh, that's pretty much it.